Hello everybody and welcome back to Gardens and Crystals with me Wesley Peterson and today we are out in my outdoor terrace garden here at our apartment in Malmö, Sweden and I thought it was about time that I did a little video tour of our outdoor terrace garden area here so you can see the marriage between my garden plants, outdoor plants and my house plants that are house plants here but maybe not where you live, somewhere out there in the big wide world. But now that it's summer, I've been able to get at least half of my house plants out into my outdoor terrace garden and they are all mixed together with my wonderful crystal skulls and my crystals at the same time. So all of the three elements of Mother Earth that I really love married together here. So I've decided to make this a music tour video because I have so many plants to show you all different shapes and sizes and colours and flowers and all my different crystal skulls and my crystals that are lying around in between all of them and it just all looks so amazing here and I feel so happy here out in the green even though we are at our apartment here right now I still need to have that element of green around and you can hear my little fountain next to me and the water on. We have a wind chime up outside as well and it's just so wonderful. We have this inner sitting area and we have an outer sitting area where we get a little bit more sunshine. But this is all under a kind of layer so none of these plants are in direct wind or they're not in direct rain either but that doesn't matter because out here I can come and spray all of these plants over very well with water when I water them and that is also perfect for my house plants so I can rinse them off if there are any insects and all sorts on those as well. So I hope you're going to enjoy this little music video and tour around of my outdoor terrace garden here in Malmö. Let's go! So here we go, let's go in for the closer look of all my beautiful house plants, garden plants and crystals and crystal skulls everywhere. Plants that are doing amazingly, my crystals are gorgeous here, enjoying being out. And here you can see my Philodendron Florida Ghost. This is what it looks like now.
So I really hope you enjoyed seeing how you can put together house plants, garden plants and crystals and make yourself a beautiful arrangement somewhere on your balcony or your outdoor area. And it doesn't have to be a huge area. You can make a little area into a wonderful green oasis where you can sit and enjoy all of the elements of a larger garden perspective in miniature. And this just feels so amazing. And I feel so good that I can get my house plants out now because they really need more light. They need to be freshened up with the water a lot more. And there are insects that go around, not just insects that could damage plants, but also insects that help the plants. And with me spraying them off and everything, it helps to keep them clear and clean as much as possible. And if I have to use any other kind of substance, I can spray them while they're out here as a natural kind of substance that can help to get rid of any insects that are damaging the plants badly but these plants are all very happy and healthy i feel wonderful here and after i've made my video i'm going to sit back and have myself a lovely lunch out here with my husband and we are just going to enjoy it here i've just come home from a five kilometer run and my husband just came home from a 12 kilometer run. So we've done our workout for the day and I am just happy to be sitting here in this green because when I'm not at my cottage, I really do miss my garden a lot there. So it's just so wonderful to have an area out the front of our apartment where I can enjoy the elements of everything together. And not only that, I really love the fact that my neighbours can walk up and down past our plants and they stop up and they look at the plants and they really enjoy and appreciate seeing the greenery here. And I've chosen a lot of outdoor plants here that are evergreen so that all year round this is green out here. I have, of course, plants that aren't and I have some that are classed as annuals, my pelagoniums this year with their lovely pink flowers on them. And I have my hosta down there. So there are some elements that die back, but for the most part, and of course these lovely bracken here, but most of my outdoor plants are evergreen. My olive tree stays green all year round here. We've had that olive tree now for five years. I'm so pleased about that. It died back twice when we moved it completely. Every single leaf fell off and we thought it was a goner and it took around about a year each time before the leaves started coming out. And this year it's had leaves now for over a year. This year it's flowered out, it's just finishing blooming and it might get some little olives on it before the season ends. So I really hope you enjoyed this little tour of our outdoor terrace garden because I haven't shown this area for quite some time now and I'm so happy and pleased about the way it's looking now. Oh, this just makes me feel so happy. So all I have to say now is thank you very much for watching Gardens and Crystals with me, Wesley Peterson. Please remember to like, subscribe and hit the bell so you know when my next video will be coming up. And I will see you again very, very soon. Goodbye.